Hello friends, this is Sathvinder Bhatia from Sukhmani Immigration Services, Brampton, Canada. I'm a regulated and licensed Canadian immigration consultant. Today, very special video because today we are sharing with you not one, two, two PNP draws. These two PNP draws are latest, just happened in the month of September. So before that, I request if you have not subscribed to the channel so far, please consider subscribing. We talk a lot about Canadian immigration news, update tips and tricks on this channel. If you like the video, share it with your family and friends. And please press the bell icon so this video comes to you as soon as we upload. Without further delay, let's get started on today's important video, which is two PNP draws. And these two PNP draws happened in the second week of September. So these two PNP draws, the first one I'm going to touch is it is a very, very important because suddenly this province has become very active and this province is none other than Saskatchewan. So Saskatchewan SINP, Saskatchewan PNP is called SINP, SNIP draw happened, SINP, this is the second draw, just seven days in September and we are getting second draw by Saskatchewan. So second PNP draw by Saskatchewan in September. Before I tell you the story about Saskatchewan, remember that Saskatchewan was not conducting this much draws. Suddenly from August, you know, we have seen there is sudden surge in the draws from Saskatchewan. So this surge clearly shows the urgency and if you belong to this sector, your chance can also come. So let's talk about the draw which happened on September 6th. September 6th, Saskatchewan did the draw and they called 760 candidates. So the analysis of these 760 candidates is like this. So on September 6th, this is the second draw in the month of September and 760 candidates were invited. 302 people invited are from the express entry. So this express entry is not federal express entry. This is a Saskatchewan express entry and occupation and demand were 458. Total 768, 760 people were invited. The cutoff score reduced further by one point. So it has now gone to 60. It was 61 in September 1st. So two important things are happening. One, Saskatchewan is conducting more draws and Second, it has reduced, continuously reducing the cutoff score. So these two important things can lead to more number of candidates in the draw. So knock codes. So please be careful that, you know, these are knock codes which are targeted again on the healthcare sector. Most of these knock codes belong to healthcare and they are registered nurse, occupational therapist, physiotherapist, your um, pharmacy assistant, all these categories are there in this draw. So this is about September 6th draw and in uh, month of September so far, this is the second draw. First draw I have already shared with you where 941 people were invited and second draw which happened on September 6th where 7 sexy people were invited, total 1701 so far. And I am very much hopeful that Saskatchewan will conduct at least one to two more draws and they will touch this time a number of 3000. So if we see what happened in August, in August, what Saskatchewan did was they called 2042 people and they conducted three draws. I am anticipating in September they will conduct four draws and they will call approximately 3000 people. So let us see how the things go. So now let's move on to another province, which is BC, beautiful British Columbia, BC PNP draw. Now BC has a very set schedule. BC conducts its PNP draws every Tuesday, but today is Wednesday. Then you will say why the draw is there today? Because Monday was holiday. It was a Labor Day long weekend. So because of that schedule moved one day and that's why the draw came in today. 
So now let's look at the draw. So BC PNP categories are must to understand before we look into the draw. So let's first have a look at the BC PNP categories. So express entry EEBC, this is the like many provinces, they have their own express entry system. Just like you saw Saskatchewan had it. Similarly, BC also has a, their own express entry system. And then they have skills immigration. Then they have entrepreneur immigration. And then there is also BC Tech. This program was called BC Tech Pilot. But now this has become a regular program and BC PNP Tech. Under Express Entry and Skills Immigration, there are further many subcategories. So uh, you can have a look on that. Now let's actually see what happened in the draw. So draw, as I said, came today, September 7th. And this is the screenshot from the draw. So as you know, BC conducts its draw always in two parts, a general draw and a targeted draw. So in this general draw, tech occupations are also included. Now let's look at the targeted draw. Under the targeted draw, this is the two, this time they have, in the targeted draw, they have invited very few people. So let's have the analysis of how the draw looks like. Total BC has called 375 people. Out of 375 people, 361 are under the general draw, draw number one. Draw number two, 14 people were called, which is a targeted draw. Targeted draw again happened in the category of early childhood educators, which is ECE, not code 4214. Eight people were invited and five people are invited in the healthcare sector. So less than five. So this is total four is invited. And now when you look at the total things, you will see that slowly the number of early childhood educators is reducing. Maybe they have reached the mark, but who knows? Let's see how the next draw comes up. But for now, the number has reduced for early childhood educators. So now one more important thing, BC has clearly put their priorities on their website. And these priorities are tech occupation, healthcare occupation, childcare occupation, and other which includes veterinary doctor and animal health technologist. So these are the priorities which are still there and BC is following the same priorities. Now let's have a look at how many people BC has invited through its PNP draws in 2022. So I am sharing here with you month as well as number of draws and how many people. So if you look at this data, you will see in September, First, this was the first draw and that's why this is shaded. So first draw in September happened on 7th of September and 375 people were called and total till now BC has invited 6,482 people. So I am very much sure that BC will touch around 10,000 by end of the year. So 10,000 I am anticipating that BC will call through its BC PNP. So this is all about BC PNP as well as Saskatchewan. If you want to discuss your own file or your profile, you can give us a call or you can reach out to our office for an appointment. Our office is located in Brampton, email ID, phone numbers, everything is shared here with you. Very important thing. If you have not subscribed to the channel so far, please consider subscribing. And thank you very much for watching the video. Thanks.